hey guys so in this video of solid works we are going to see how can you make geneva wheel so let's start to make geneva wheel let's start from front view so it has a circular hole so for that let's make a hole first of all and dimension are in millimeter and from smart from smart dimension first of all click on sketch and then smart dimension and the diameter of this small hole is 0.25 and then we have another circle which has diameter 0.5 so again make a circle go centric to it and give the dimension and 0.5 so we have two circles here now the third circle which is the con which is the construction circle for making plots we have to make a construction circle having diameter 2 mm so click on circle and then if you make a circle go centric to it having radius 1 or say diameter 2 what you have to do you have to click on the circle and use for construction so now we have A construction circle and two circle. Now, what we have again go to sketch. We have a bigger circle which has we have uh, another construction circle you can use it construction or you can make it whole circle i think you can make it whole circle so it is has diameter of four so what you have to do click on circle this give the dimension to the circle and it is four so we have this for cocentric circle now what we have we have eight slots and eight arcs so the first of so let's make a first slot here in between and then and then we can use the mirror and then we can use the linear sketch circular sketch pattern to make the pattern on this wheel so let's start with making a slot so the slot width from here is a 0.25 mm so for that what you have to do you have to make a slot till here so from here to here you make a line let's make a center line from here to here let's make a line from here here and make it for construction so for construction we make a we make a line now we have a slot here which has the uh, width of 0.25 the total width is 0.25 so from here to here it will be 0.25 divided by 2 so again let's make a line from here to here and give the dimension to this one as to 5 divided by 2 and let's say this is 1 it's over to 1 so we don't need to give dimension to it so we have given this point and then what we can do we can make a line from here to here we 
it should be straight here so now what is the next option which you need to do so as you can see this line is little bit tilted what you do you make it vertical so now we have an arc here which has a radius of 0.25 by 2 so make an arc So now it's good and then we have a line here so that again make a line from this point to this point again it's tilted make it vertical and it's touching to this circle so now what we have to do we have to make a pattern of this we have to give dimension first this one this is one and it's fully defined now so we have defined this slot now what we have you have to cut this line here so you have to use trim entities go for here trim the entities like this so you have trim the entities here so it's now completed if you want to give dimension you can give dimension for this which is radius 0.3 so now it's fully defined again so we have defined the slot now so we have made this slot now what we can do we can use the circular sketch pattern you have to pattern this so as you can see you are getting the the the, the pattern in the yellow line but now we want this is eight slot so you can write here eight so as you can see we can get eight slots now so we have got the eight slot trim the entities like this so now it's so now we have to make an arc on this segment as you can see here so we have the radius of arc is 0.5 mm so what we need to do so as we need to make an arc here which is has the radius of 0.5 mm which is at the center of this arc so first of all let's make a line for construction from this to this center is here which is which is at angle of 67.5 so let's make an line having length so let's first give the degree define the angle and the line angle is The angle is 67.5 and 90 minus 60.5, which is 22.5 from here to here. And the length of this line is the radius of the bigger circle plus the radius of bigger circle plus the half of the radius of the slot which we want which is 0.5 so 0.5 divided by 2 which is plus 0.25 so 
so it is 2.25 the length of this line now we can make an arc on this center which has a radius of 0.5 from this one to this line and if you, after making the line this this arc you can give the radius which is 0.5 so now this arc is defined you can trim the remaining part here like this so you have defined the arc now you can what you can do you can use again circular pattern select this pattern and give it as you can see here all right and then trim the entity so that's the Geneva wheel which you can make easily if you use these steps of using pattern and having the known geometry dimensions so let me Give the dimension of Geneva wheel to you so that you can easily make it at your home. So these are the eight slots, eight arcs, dimension of outer inner wheel. 